my question is about um, Montreal lawyer Julius Gray, who says that he is uh, going to file a lawsuit in Superior Court uh, to because he wants parents to have the choice between sending their kids to school or uh, choosing distance learning, which is the case in Ontario. Uh, why is Quebec not considering this? Why not give parents the choice between, if they're really not comfortable sending their kids back to school yet, why not give them the choice to continue distance learning? Well, in Quebec, going to school is mandatory from 6 to 16. Uh, parents has the choice to, uh, to opt for homeschooling if they, if they want to do so. But to have the right to uh, have some services for learning, learning from a distance with the help of the teachers from the school service centers, uh, we've decided with the Santé Public directors that we have to, to have uh, maybe a, a difficulty related to COVID-19. So if it presents a risk for the help, of course, we will, uh, we will help those kids to learn at home with the help of our teachers and support staff. But if, we, if the kids don't have some, uh, some, some sickness related to COVID-19, the best place is to go to school, of course. We've heard a, a number of um, parents say that they've, they're having trouble getting those medical exemptions from their doctors, particularly when it concerns someone else in the family. So maybe a, a parent or a grandparent is immunocompromised, and so they want their kids to stay at home, and they're having trouble getting a doctor to sign off on that. Um, what do you say to those parents, or what do you say to those doctors? Well, I can't. I can't replace the judgment of the doctors, of course, but what uh, the Santé, uh, our uh, health, uh, public health director said was pretty clear. Uh, students have the right to have all the service for, for learning from a distance if they have something related to COVID-19 or if something who's living at the same address has those uh, those problems with COVID-19. So uh, I think it's pretty clear. Um, just to follow up on the Julius Gray story, are, are you concerned, because Mr. Gray's uh, people who use, who, who try to pursue um, the path of Mr. Gray's constitutional uh, uh, challenge will invoke uh, that it's their fundamental right to not send their children to school or to homeschool. Are you, are you worried this will create a double standard, a, double, a, a two tier system of education if, if this court proceeding goes ahead? Well, because it's in court, I can't comment that much, but I can say that of course parents has a right to, uh, to choose for homeschooling if they want to. And uh, I can reassure that if, if uh, they have some problem related to COVID-19, the kids or the parents living at the same address, they will have full support from the school. 